and even by her friends, but she never listened to them, and it's a good thing because she is a four-time Grammy nominee and is currently promoting her new album, The Best of Brannigan. Please welcome Laura Brannigan. <laughs> joining us today. Thanks for so having we've been me. talking about people who are constantly being put, put down by others. How did it make you feel when people told you that you would never make it as a singer? Um, never discouraged me. You can't be discouraged in this business, especially. You have to be obsessed. Very true. And uh, I just went after it. And, you know, I, I wanted to sing and that was it. And people would say, um, oh, you know, if you haven't made it by 19, you should forget it. And Mm -hmm. And all my friends would say that, and their parents, and so my family was So how old were you when you finally got that big break? 20. <laughs> so that, I guess they were just 21. a year off. That's great, yeah, though. True. So what is it like for a woman to be in the record business? Because I know we hear so many negative things about it. Is it hard? No, it's not. I, I think it's just a matter of being true to yourself and um, not taking yourself too seriously. I think that's a, a big problem that people do in this business. Mm -hmm. So that you just, I'm in it for the song and the music, and that's mm -hmm. it. And so I, even, even after being such a huge success, I mean, you sold 10 million albums. Um, mm -hmm. Do you feel as if you still need that validation from people even now, or no? No, I think it's the, uh, I mean, the greatest, the greatest high in the world is being on stage and performing and having the audience there with you. That's it. You know, that's what I love to do. And that, I guess, is a form of validation every time I'm up there. Yeah. And, uh... So that'll never go away. Um, when, I, when I first signed to my record company, yeah. they had offered me, um, we cut a few songs and then they, got, uh, they wanted to get me off the label. Mm -hmm. And so they, um, they offered me a very large sum of money to buy me out. Mm -hmm. And I said, no, I haven't had my shot. You take your money and let me have an album. And so they did and I came out with Gloria. And that's <laughs> a big, that's great. Yeah. It's a because surprise. <laughs> You, you took a big risk turning down a guaranteed sum of money and risking yeah. your own talent Especially that way. Especially because I had no money. <laughs> yeah, that is a, that's, a, that's a real vote of, of confidence that you had in yourself. I did. But for, even for a moment, did it ever sink in, maybe I'm not going the right way, maybe these no, people could be right? never. What advice do you have for our panel today? Just never give up. Ever. <laughs> Don't listen to anybody else but yourself. Never, ever give up. When we come back, Laura sings us a hit from her new CD, The Best of Brannigan. Stay with us.